Welcome to the epic travel adventures, today let's catch a bullet train from Hiroshima to Kyoto, Japan. As we take a ride, let's experience the bullet train, the city of Kyoto and the Kyoto Hotel together. Join me in exploring the first day of this historic city together. Where are we getting tickets to? Tell me. Tickets to Kyoto, we're in Hiroshima right now. From Hiroshima? to Kyoto on Shinkansen. One-way tickets to Kyoto cost 11,620 yen or about $110 per person for the Nozomi, the fastest bullet train in Japan with the reserved seats. It is very easy to buy the Shinkansen or the bullet train tickets and you can do it from the sole service kiosk or the ticket office at any major JR station. We're riding on Nozomi 34. What track is that? That's track 14. Okay, so we and should we go to the right. we got reserved seats. These are the traditional Hiroshima pastries, momiji manju made out of buckwheat and rice cake and common chocolate, red bean paste and matcha green tea flavors. Uh, traditional Hiroshima uh, sweet. It's a uh, chocolate you got here and I got uh, this one, traditional. So let's try and see how it okay. tastes. yourself chocolate mm. what does it taste like tell us tell the viewers what it tastes like it's like a donut with like almost like chocolate chocolate pudding should we should we buy the whole box <laughs> you're gonna buy the whole box mm. <laughs> Traditional Hiroshima pastry. Bean paste. <laughs> yeah, it's different. It's kind of squishy and soft, and they come in different flavors. This one I got is the bean paste but a little, uh, maybe kind of a little bit like a donut, but not really, pretty cool, not bad. If you would like to find out more information about the Shinkansen bullet train, see my bullet train to Osaka video or click on the card above. As you heard, all the stops are announced in Japanese and English and give you a brief moment to enter or exit the train.
This is the Chuhai, a Japanese flavored and carbonated alcoholic drink. On the bullet train, you can eat and drink. You can bring your own food or purchase it on the train. Finally, we arrive to the Kyoto station. The lockers that you see on the left and right is where you can store your stuff for a decent price. Kyoto is the capital of Kyoto Prefecture in the Kansai region of Japan. Kyoto is located on the main island of Honshu. Let's take a quick tour at the Kyoto Century Hotel where we'll be lodging. I want to show you the main areas as well as my hotel room so you can see how it is in Japan. Coming to the main entrance of the Kyoto Century Hotel, right off the get-go you can feel how luxurious the place is. This is the main hall area where you also eat breakfast and dinner. The breakfast here is as elegant as it gets. This is the 5th floor hallway and as you can see you are looking straight down to the main hall area. Entering the hotel room there is a desk, a coffee table, a TV and a bed with a lazy chair. The room itself is not very big but by the Japanese standards it's actually spacious. The bathroom though is awesome, let's check it out. The sink is separated from the main bath. Entering the bath, you actually shower right on these floor tiles. So this is where you actually shower. You stand on this tile and shower up here. And this is the tub and that's the bathroom. By the entrance, there is a Japanese bidet toilet with a sink above it. And like everything in Japan, there are lots of buttons on everything. This toilet can wash different parts of your body at various pressures and temperatures at different cleaning modes. These are traditional Japanese sandals known as gera. They're typically worn into the bath houses or festivals with yokara aka kimono. These are some of the common areas inside of the hotel. It is dark now, but the city is alive. Kyoto, with a population of just under 1.46 million people in 2020, is on the number 7 most populous cities in Japan. As you will see in my upcoming videos, Kyoto is the cultural capital of Japan. There is an unbelievable amount of history here. The glowing tower in the distance is the famous Kyoto Tower made from steel. With a height of 131 meters or 430 feet, it is the tallest structure in Kyoto. In fact, the Kyoto Tower stands on top of a 9-story building. If you're interested, there is an observation deck at 100 meters or 328 feet. This is a little replica of a Shinto shrine right by the Kyoto station. This is the Porta Dining, an underground area where you can find a lot of shops and many places to eat. Let's go inside and check it out. Isn't this crazy? All underground here.
And finally, a quick tour inside the Kyoto station where you can catch Shinkansen and JR trains. Kyoto station. That looks like Shinkansen, right? This is like a Grand Central. Yeah, there's a JR for Shinkansen. In the next video, we're going to explore Kyoto like never before. We're going to see the famous Gion district and the Yasaka Pagoda aka the Hokanji Temple. Join me in this amazing adventure of Japan, only on the Epic Travel Adventures. And if you want to see more of my awesome videos, then make sure to follow, subscribe, like, and of course hit that bell down below so that you do not miss any of my new content. See you in my next video.